flight suits and helmets that fit just right, boots that don't pinch toes, and a cockpit where everything sits within reach. The Naval Air Warfare Center Aircraft Division is leading a comprehensive study to update size requirements for aviators and aircraft. It's the first of its kind since the 1960s. Of course, our population has changed drastically, demographically. In the 1960s, we didn't go out and sample women. We really didn't have that many women to sample in terms of air crew at that time. But also, we have more minority males in the population as well. So we really want to go out and get a good sample, representative sample. Participating in the anthropometric study is easy. After checking in, service members will be measured and scanned to look at things like standing and sitting heights and body weight. Organizers will also take measurements for leg length along with hand, foot, and head sizes. Each and every study participant is important. The data collected will benefit generations of warfighters to come. Participation in this study, especially females and non-white males, is vitally important to ensure that gear is available, our gear fits, our survival equipment is available and ready to be used by us, and that we can affect future aircraft acquisition and future air crew eligibility. Because in a survival situation, we need to have gear that fits. 